Setting out from base camp, destination, we were told, was just around the corner. But it was no walk in the park on these rocky trails more than 5,000 meters above sea level. For meteorologist Zhao Huabiao, it was a breeze. Last year, I made a conscious decision to map my footprints and found between September and November, I walked about 300 kilometers. Zhao studies the weather and climate on the Tibetan Plateau, a vast elevated area in western China that changes regional weather and feeds more than 10 of Asia's greatest rivers. It's also home to the world's tallest mountain, Choma Langma. The goal today is to install an automatic weather station at the foot of the mountain. We're now 5,200 meters above sea level, and behind me is the majestic Mount Everest. We can see that scientists now are setting up a weather station here, and this is going to be the lowest altitude one in a series of weather stations that they're going to set up all the way to the mountaintop at 8,800 meters. The machine measures wind speed and direction, temperature, humidity, atmospheric pressure and solar radiation. The Qinghai Tibet Plateau is the third pole. It's very high and the temperature changes at different altitudes. Chumulama is high even in this region. We study the evaluational gradient here so that we can better understand the entire third pole. Back at base camp, we meet what's going to be the world's highest weather station. Specifically designed to be lighter, easier to assemble, it's going up to the summit of Chomolangma, 8,800 meters high on the backs of experienced local Tibetan climbing guides. This is our most special mission, to install a weather station 8,800 meters high. We must complete it fast so that the data can transmit back to the base camp and to the hands of scientists. Braving fierce weather and low levels of oxygen, the team has already installed the second and third highest weather stations on the mountain. Zhao Huabiao heads a team at 7,000 meters high and is waiting for good news from above. Pao Yuan, CGTN, at Choma